Welcome back to our channel. Today we're diving into a world of architectural marvels and jaw-dropping engineering feats. Buckle up because we're taking you on a whirlwind tour of China's most from bridges that amazed journey. Remember to hit that like button, share the wonder, and join our ever-growing community. Now let's unravel the story behind China's mega projects that are reshaping the future. Get ready to be wowed by the Shanghai Tower, a skyscraper that's redefining the skyline and China's economic prowess. Flashback to 2015 and boom, the Shanghai Tower bursts onto the scene, soaring 2073 feet, 632 meters high, dwarfing the city beneath it. It's not just a building, it's a statement of China's economic might climbing to become the third tallest in the world and reigning as the tallest in the land. Imagine this nine cylindrical towers stacked one upon the other, creating a mesmerizing spiral reaching towards the heavens. It's like a futuristic dance of architecture. But what makes it really stand out is its outer double skin construction, clear glass on the outside, and a layer of perforated aluminum alloy on the inside team, up to control sunlight and heat, while giving the building a stunning visual appeal. But here's where it gets really cool. This tower is a true eco-warrior. Its energy-efficient design slashes its carbon footprint, setting new standards for sustainable architecture. And guess what it's bagged? The Platinum Certification for Leadership in Energy and Environmental Design Translation. It's a planet-friendly superstar. And it's not just about height and green credentials. This tower is a buzzing hub of activity, from commercial spaces to retail wonders and recreational zones. Oh, and don't forget the piece to resistance, the tallest observation deck in the entire world, sitting proudly at a whopping 562 meters, 1847 feet above the ground. So let's raise a toast to the Shanghai Tower, a marvel of design, sustainability, and a towering symbol of China's boundless ambitions. Get ready for the ultimate bridge thrill, introducing the Ping Tang Bridge, a gravity-defying masterpiece that'll make your heart race hold on to your hats, because this bridge is not just a bridge. It's a jaw-dropping, sky-kissing wonder that stands 565.5 meters high. Yep, that's right. It's so towering that even the iconic Golden Gate Bridge in San Francisco would give it a respectful nod. Imagine this. The Empire State Building could practically squeeze under it and there'd still be room for a jumbo jet to do a takeoff twirl. This engineering marvel doesn't just connect the mountainous provinces of Shiny Way. It transforms a four-hour journey into a blink and you'll miss it. Adventure. And the views, they're so mind-blowing, you'll feel like you're cruising through the clouds, but hold on to your seat. Because there's more to this story. This technical wizardry is nestled in a region that seems to have a thing for tall bridges. Three out of the five tallest bridges in the world are right here battling it out for the tallest crown. And oh boy, did these architects work their magic. They turned challenges like caves and cracks into stepping stones for these sky-high dreams now. Before you get tangled in the web of highest versus tallest, let's set the record straight. The title for the tallest goes to France's Milo Viaduct, but it's all a matter of how you measure it. Deck height versus the whole structure, it's like comparing apples and oranges, but way more exhilarating. But here's the kicker. China isn't just building bridges, they're diving deep with enormous underwater tunnels. A realm where tubes become aquatic pathways and heights soar to unimaginable realms, so buckle up thrill seekers. Because the Ping Tang Bridge is just the beginning of China's sky-high adventures that'll leave you reaching for the stars. Hold on to your seats because China's high-speed train network is rewriting the travel playbook like never before. Fast forward to 2023, and the United States is gearing up to unveil a high-speed rail system that's set to conquer a whopping 22,000 miles, 35,000 kilometers of tracks. Yes, you heard that, right? the biggest and fastest network on the planet. It's like a speed demon's dream come true. China's been in the fast lane too. Creating a supercharged high-speed rail network over the past decade, these trains can zoom at an eye-watering 270 miles per hour, 355 kilometers per hour, zipping through major cities and cozy towns. The result, a travel revolution that's changing how Americans explore their own backyard millions, are in for shorter journeys, and greater access to amazing destinations. But there's more to this story than just speed. This high-speed rail extravaganza isn't just boosting China's economy. It's a job generator giving rise to new opportunities and expanding the horizons of the transportation industry. 
But uh, here's where the plot thickens while these networks are feats of engineering brilliance. There's a catch. The energy and resources needed to keep these speed demons. Demons going, raise questions about long-term profitability. It's a challenge that can't be overlooked. So let's applaud China's audacious high-speed rail journey. It's not just, just about tracks and trains. It's about transforming travel-creating jobs and facing the uphill battle of maintaining the future of transportation. Prepare to be swept away by the majestic Hangzhou Bay Bridge, a true marvel that's redefining sea-crossing journeys. This bridge is like the ultimate connector, joining the dots between Draw Bay and China, effortlessly linking Shanghai and Ningbo with a distance of 22.2 miles, 35.7 kilometers. It's one of the planet's longest marine bridges, setting the stage for an unforgettable ride. But hold on, because this is where the plot thickens. The region dances with nature's whims from typhoons to tidal surges and earthquakes. It's a wild ride, so the bridge had to be built to not just withstand, but conquer these forces. How steel piles stepped in bringing their strength to the party. And then there's the cable stay design adding an extra layer of resilience. Imagine this, brave souls worked through unpredictable weather and crashing waves to bring this beauty to life. New techniques had to be crafted to match Mother Nature's unpredictable mood swings. But that's not all. This isn't just any bridge. It's a lifeline for the city, relieving traffic congestion and making journeys smoother than ever. And it's a sight to behold with six lanes and a breathtaking stretch. It's become a tourist hotspot, and the cherry on top, an enchanting artificial island named the Oriental Bright Pearl, complete with restaurants, commercial spots, and a jaw-dropping observation deck that offers panoramic views of the harbor and the bridge, stretching out like a futuristic masterpiece. So there you have it, folks, the Hangzhou Bay Bridge, a symphony of engineering resilience and a voyage that'll steal your breath away. Hold your breath, space enthusiasts. Because we're diving into a colossal cosmic marvel, China proudly boasts the world's largest telescope. And when we say large, we're talking a whopping 500-meter aperture picture. This, it's like a mammoth eye gazing into the mysteries of the universe. This massive spherical telescope calls Guizhou Province its home. Nestled in the dawning depression, the backstory hold tight. This behemoth took a solid five years to come to life, ringing in at around $180 million in the good old U.S. dollars. The numbers are impressive, but let's talk diameter. A staggering 500 meters that stretches across the heavens. And yes, it's a radio telescope with a single dish that does the cosmic eavesdropping. Now here's where it gets even cooler. The 454 panels that make up the dish are like cosmic contortionists. They can rearrange themselves into a parabolic pattern, like celestial chameleons adjusting to capture radio waves from space. This flexible dance of panels gives it a unique edge, letting it listen in ways other telescopes can't. But wait, there's more this space. Sentinel aptly named FAST is on a mission to dive into the origins of the universe, track down intelligent life beyond our solar system, and uncover the secrets of pulsars and other celestial wonders. And it's darn good at its job. It's already discovered over 100 new pulsars, those fast-spinning neutron stars that give off mesmerizing beams of radiation. But it doesn't stop there. This cosmic detective is also helping us map out the Milky Way study the elements floating in the interstellar medium, and even probe the distribution of hydrogen in our galactic neighborhood. So there you have it, folks, fast, the 500-meter marvel. That's putting its ears to the cosmos and making breathtaking discoveries, one radio wave at a time. Get ready for an incredible feat of engineering, folks. China has done it again, claiming the title for the world's tallest bridge. But this isn't your average bridge. It links Yan'an County to Guizhou Province in southwest China. Stretching high above the Beipan River Canyon, meet the Bay Panjong, Bridge Dude, the planet's highest bridge hold on to your hats. It reaches a mind-blowing 1824 feet, 565 meters, from deck to ground. That's like stacking up three Statue of Liberties. But wait, there's more of this. Bridge sits a staggering 1850 feet, 454 meters above sea level, creating an aerial path over the Bay Pan River. Ready for the facts, this epic bridge spans a whopping 4,396 feet, 1340 meters from end to end, 
reaching over a canyon that plunges more than 1,200 feet, 365 meters deep. But here's the kicker. This wasn't a simple task. It took engineers and builders three years from 2013 to 2016 to make this towering wonder a reality. But that's not all the engineering wizardry behind it is equally astonishing. Massive pillars, cutting-edge technology, they left no stone unturned to ensure this towering marvel was as solid as it was stunning. So give it up for the Bepanjang Bridge Douche, a remarkable blend. Of audacious vision and human brilliance reaching new heights and beyond, get set for an urban masterpiece right in the heart of Shanghai, introducing the Hongqiao Integrated Transportation Hub, a dazzling creation nestled in downtown Shanghai. Hold on to your hats, because this hub costing a cool $1.22 billion brings together a whole bunch of transport options buses, metros, high-speed trains, and even airplane is all under one roof. It's like a transportation. Paradis designed to make your commuting breeze, the show kicked off in 2020 as part of the grand infrastructure design for that year's expo. And guess what? It's not just any hub, it's the ultimate go-to for public transport in the city. Imagine this at the heart of the action. Is Shanghai International Airport, China's fourth busiest airport flights, domestic and international buzzing all around you. But wait, there's more, right? Across is the Shanghai Hongqiao Railway Station, making sure you're seamlessly connected and the vibe, oh, it's not just about transit. There's a retail and business extravaganza that'll keep you entertained while you wait for your ride. This hub has grown so big that it's become a tourist hotspot all on its own. And here's the cherry on top. This hub's success has set the benchmark for transport projects, not just in China, but across the globe. Other cities are looking at this urban marvel with awe taking notes on how to raise their own transportation game. So hats off to the Hongqiao Integrated Transportation Hub for showing us how transportation can be a spectacular experience. It's more than just a hub. It's a city's heartbeat in motion dive into China's aquatic wonder an underwater tunnel that's rewriting the transportation game. This groundbreaking tunnel, a keystone of transportation, is taking shape near the charming town of Wuzhou in China's Jiangxi province. But here's the twist. It's not just any tunnel. It's an underwater marvel nestled beneath the scenic Poyang Lake. We're talking about the Tuhu Tunnel, a feat that's shaking up the landscape. Imagine this over 6.5 kilometers, 4 miles of tunnel, Stretching beneath the shimmering waters of China's Tahu Lake, hold your breath, this engineering wonder wasn't born overnight. It took a decade from 2006 to 2016 and a staggering $10 billion to craft this masterpiece that connects two cities in a flash. Let's talk numbers. This tunnel boasts two separate tubes, each packing two lanes for vehicles, ensuring a smooth ride even. In the face of earthquakes, yep, they've got safety covered. And did we mention that it slashed travel time from over an hour to a mere 10 minutes that's like turning a journey into a blink? But here's where it gets really fascinating to create this marvel. They had to conquer the challenges of the lake's muddy bed. But hey, they're not ones to back down. Specialized equipment, including massive tunnel, boring machines and techniques to layer concrete, underwater, got the job done and the payoff. Oh, it's huge. The Tuhu Tunnel isn't just a connection. It's a lifeline. It's weaving together China's cities, turbocharging the economy, and showcasing China's engineering wizardry on the global stage. So let's take a bow for the Tuhu Tunnel, a feat. That's not just shaping roads, but futures and possibilities. Step into the future with China's masterpiece in high-speed travel. The Zhengzhou East Railway Station, hold on to your hats because China's been investing big time in its rail system, and the Zhengzhou East Railway Station in Hanan Province is the shining gem in their crown situated in the bustling city of Zhengzhou. This station isn't just big. It's colossal sprawling over 3 million square feet, 300,000 square meters. If cities were superheroes, Zhengzhou would be the one with the cape, but size isn't the only claim to fame. This station is a major player in the Beijing high-speed rail system. Back in 2012, it opened its doors, boasting a whopping 14 platforms, 
and 26 passenger tracks. But here's where it gets even cooler. It's all enveloped by a jaw-dropping glass and steel structure that screams, future picture. This cutting-edge tech, at every turn from slick automatic ticket vending machines to intelligent lighting systems, this station is the epitome of a 21 Saint century travel experience. And let's not forget the mind-bending amenities that'll make you feel like you've stepped into a sci-fi movie. Oh, and the design, it's not just about looks, it's about flow. With a center hall reception areas and departure zones, this station is a marvel of passenger convenience. In fact, the whole layout is designed so that passengers naturally move in the same direction, making for a seamless travel dance. So here's to Zhengzhou East Railway Station, a symbol of modernity, efficiency, and a dash of sci-fi coolness. Get ready to be transported to the future of travel. Hold on to your seats, because China's high-speed rail network is taking us on a wild ride over the past decade. China has gone all out, crafting a spectacular high-speed rail network that's left the world in awe. Fast forward to 2023, and guess what? The United States is on track to build a high-speed rail system, spanning a mind-boggling 22,000 miles, 350,000 kilometers. Imagine zipping along tracks that stretch from here to the moon and back twice. Yep, that's the kind of grandeur we're talking about. But here's the twist. China's already there by changing the game, with trains that zoom at up to 250 kilometers per hour or 160 miles per hour. They've completely revolutionized how people move around the nation. Think about it. Big cities are now just a high-speed ride away. And getting from A to B has never been faster or smoother. The best part, it's not just about quicker travel. It's a turbo boost for China's economy, creating jobs and opportunities at every station. But like any epic story, there's a twist. Despite being one of the most advanced rail networks globally, China's high-speed rail has faced its share of challenges. Critics have raised eyebrow. The high ticket prices and ethical concerns, plus the sheer energy and effort required for maintenance, have experts wondering if the system's long-term profitability is on solid tracks. Building this high-speed rail empire was no small feat. It showed us the hurdles that come with handling a colossal project like this. But here's 